did signing day. The following day, they fired the running back coach. Can't do anything now. You signed a national letter of intent. Went through like three or four games. We went and got our ass kicked at Arizona State, and then they fired Kiff. When Sarkeesian came in, you know, no real issues. Just wasn't a real mesh or fit there. I went in and got all my stuff together to transfer. And if you're the head coach, I hand you a piece of paper. This is, you know, I'm asking for my release, blah, blah, blah. You get seven days. In that seven days, that's when they can come back and say, all right, you can't transfer to Notre Dame or stand, wherever. You know what I'm saying? They can put all their blocks in. It's talking to Notre Dame, Michigan, and University of Illinois. Seventh day comes up. SC never sent us anything. And mind you, I, I put in my request right after spring ball. You know, a lot of coaches take off, they're mm-hmm. on vacation, doing whatever they're doing. If they forgot and they didn't say anything and I was clear to go anywhere, I was going to go to Notre Dame. That's that's what I wanted to do. Somebody in my camp started freaking out. They're like, we haven't got this release yet, blah, blah, blah. I'm calling. Unbeknownst to me. They called and did their thing. And SC was like, oh, it's seven days. Like, and I mean, we were down to like an hour left. So they sent me back. They blocked, you know, Notre Dame, all the Pac-12 schools, all that. No, I mean, I didn't tell anybody that, but mm-hmm. that's how close I was to going there. That's sure. crazy. It so is. there's an alternate universe where you guys were teammates 